Hey everyone, and welcome to the bro. Welcome back to the bro. Let's play. Um. What? Oh, wrong button. Okay. <laughs> Tried to leave. Apparently, I didn't realize you couldn't use the stairs out to quit. Mouse again. At least I noticed it early this time, right? Is there a secret in here? Looks like there should be. Apparently not. Huh. Just a dead end, apparently. That's weird. I don't think there are normally secrets on the first floor, actually. So, that makes sense. So, apparently, there's two locked doors on this floor. That's actually pretty handy. Uh -oh. Normally, when there's two, one of them is going to be sort of mediocre and have the key, and then the other one is usually pretty decent. Seems to be how it works, anyway. Honestly, they probably have... like, a similar item pool that they could have, and I've just gotten really... wow, three locked doors? Really oddly lucky with the last doors having the best options. Yeah, apparently there's three locked doors here. That's weird. I don't see a key in that one. Huh. I don't think I've seen a floor with three locked doors. Uh, apparently gas. Okay, that's not too bad, actually. The monsters coming out of the walls is pretty weird, but, you know. Um, okay, this is actually pretty bad. Never mind. I was wrong. Er... Where was there a Healy plant? Run away, run away, run away. <laughs> it's a lot of fucking rats. Give them that. Okay. Fight them off by the Healy plant. Whew. Well, that definitely could have gone worse. It's a lot of fucking rats. Damn. So which door is this? Okay, that's for that door. Ring of regeneration, a rapier, and a ring of wisdom, or the key. I'll try the key. Are there still rats coming out from there? It's like a clown car of rats. Okay, so that's gonna be the last door. There's a lot of fucking rats. Um, dagger, staff of tunneling, staff of discord, and another key. I'll take the key. And what are you hiding? Levitation charm, invisibility charm, ring of clairvoyance, some armor, and an axe. Huh. Okay, I want the invisibility charm, so which one is that? Oh, sorry about that. Sorry, I forgot to. Yeah, okay. Uh, invisibility charm is that one. Okay. So, I think that'll help out. Being able to go invisible is usually pretty handy. At least I think it's normally pretty handy. Doesn't always work, but... Let's kill that before I get near it and end up falling down to floor 3 before I'm done exploring. Look at the um, dungeon building algorithm for this game. It's really interesting. I'm not sure how they built it. Like with original Rogue, it's pretty easy to tell how it's built because it's basically just, you know, build a couple rooms. Oh, my armor's protected. They build a couple rooms and then they connect them with uh, hallways. It's pretty simple, but it works. 
And this one, I'm not sure if they build the rooms first or what. Like, I don't know. I would think they. Mouse again, sorry. I would think they start from a position of. Building out the rooms. And then adding features on top of the rooms. That's how I would think they went about it, but I'm not sure. Kind of interested to find out. I mean, sticking through source code, though. Oh, staff. Cool. Don't know what it does yet, but it can hurt. Actually, it could. It could turn a monkey into a dragon or something. So, definitely could hurt. Before I go down, I want to test some things. Uh, e is enchantment. Enchantment. Uh, charm, actually. Visibility. H is strength. Uh, brown is paralyze. K is creeping death. Leaving. Uh, that was G. F is more death. Healy spores, and I'll test this out while I'm here. Ooh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Oh, the fire doesn't seem to be spreading too badly. Yeah, it could have been worse. That's good staff to have, though. Range fiery attack. L is life. And E is levitation. Okay. Well, I'm just gonna skip by the fire. Since I'm levitating anyway, might as well. Right? It's over here. Not a lot. Okay. Said no, thank you. <sighs> no means no, damn it. <laughs> no, your monsters are giving you an excuse to be rude. Pink potion, lavender potion. Skill mail. I don't know if I have the strength for that. I know I've had some strengths improving things, but. I do, but my leather armor is just as good right now, and it's protected from acid, so I'll keep that on. Uh, being protected from acid is kind of a big deal for me. I don't like stripping or changing my equipment just because an acid blob slime monster thing happens to be nearby. It's really annoying. Oh, there's a goblin trap down here. Yep, for you. Kill your captor. Don't know where you ran off to. Apparently there's money over here that I forgot about. Or no, actually that was on fire, that's why I left it. Okay. Well, it seems the fire cleared up now. Another scroll of enchanting. More rats. Uh but if I do that and run away. It's probably overkill, but you know, why not? Let's go identify I'll identify the I'll identify potion. Incineration. What? Oh, potion of make fire. Gotcha. And detect magic. Okay. 
So there's magic down there that I need to sort of break into, apparently. Looks like it's blocked by wooden barrier. Yeah. Okay, I can handle that, I think. Yep, totally can. I just need to wait it out. Not hungry, so eat while I'm here. Clairvoyance, leather armor, telepathy. Hmm. Kinda want telepathy, but I think the ring might be better. It's a sword. Actually, I probably have the strength for a sword, don't I? Where is it? No. Yeah, the sword's definitely the better option here. What button is it on? Okay, okay. I lose very little accuracy and gain a lot of damage from this, so I'm pretty sure that was the best choice. Why are there still rats? Didn't I light you all on fire or something? Oh, I have an uh, enchantment too, don't I? A scroll of enchanting. Uh, two, actually. Don't I? No. Just the one. So, I'll enchant my sword. So that's good. I have a decent weapon going down to the next floor. Normally at this point I would still be using the dagger, I think. I don't like losing a lot of accuracy, so I tend to hold on to the dagger for a long time, just because it's the only weapon that doesn't really penalize your accuracy a lot early on. Once you get a lot of strength, it's not so bad, but... Unless you find a couple early potions of strength, your accuracy is just terrible with anything except the dagger. And I'd rather actually connect with my attacks than have them hit harder most of the time. There's a lot of lava down here. And potion of levitation is handy. Hallucinating is not. Swill of identify. Okay. Do I have anything to identify? Actually, I don't think I know... Oh, I yeah, know, because that was... Yeah, I don't have anything to identify right now. Okay. Well, I can hold on to it then. More enchanting. Let's go. Did I miss a secret door? Must have. It's probably in here then. Apparently not. Huh. There's gotta be a secret door around there somewhere. Huh. Is it over here? Go away, jackals. I thought there was... Huh. Oh, I see the door I missed. Doesn't even look like it's hidden at all. I'm just bad at games in general. Aquamarine potion. I have some identify scrolls, I think. Yeah. Oh. Potion of confusion. Okay. Wait, didn't I drink one of those? Apparently not. Where's the stairs down? Have I not found them yet? Oh, no, I walked right past them. <sighs> I'm observant today, apparently. Um, 
Sven Ogre. Hello, friend. Hello, friend that's twice my size and probably going to murder everything ever. I'm happy to rescue you. Damn. I didn't know you could get ogre friends, especially not this early on. We're only on level five. Where's that arrow turret? All right, it's over there. Mm, yeah, I realized that going down the stairs was probably not a good plan. I'm pretty sure my ogre friend just died in the poisonous gas, which kind of sucks, but... Oh well, I briefly had an ogre friend. And briefly having an ogre friend is, ne is better than never having one, I suppose. Probably doesn't mean there's gonna be, like, enemy ogres early on. This early on too though. I wouldn't be surprised if it did. It's... I don't know, I think you can run into enemies into monsters as allies before you can run into them as enemies. Because you get monkeys on level one a lot too. And they don't normally start attacking attacking you until level two. Secret door. There you are. More paralysis potion. Um, another gas trap. Happy I saw that one before I stepped on it. Tan and an identify potion. Scroll. Identify the potion. Potion of descent. Okay. I'll read the scroll. I great monster. That's not so bad considering most of the monsters here are already dead. Wow, well, this has been going pretty fast actually. Don't want to be uh, you saw me, didn't you? Yeah, you definitely saw me now. Didn't really want to fight that. Treasure room with the chainmail. It's not bad. I'll try that. A uh, recharging. Okay. I should probably use this charm more often, but I want to save it for when there's cl something clearly too dangerous for me to actually fight. Right now, most of the stuff I don't want to fight is just like kobolds and goblins. I want to save it for, for when I'm trying to get away from like an ogre or something, or a troll. I think there are trolls in this, I can't remember now. Most roguelikes have trolls. So I'm trying to hold on to the invisibility for the time being. That's an acid mounted and goblin. Kind of annoying. Actually. Well now, kill the goblin with fire. Okay, apparently I'll kill a couple things with fire. Including a door. So I take it that was explosive swamp gas. Seems that, yeah. Walk out of my way, please. I need to hide. What do I have? What do I have? Um. Descent. Yep, down we go. 
Okay, and invisible. Confusion, levitation. Arm's not recharged yet. What does the scroll do? Pisses off everything nearby by breaking the walls. Gotcha. Telepathy. Well, I can drink the potion of strength at least. And I think I'll. so it recharges a bit faster. Damn it. <sighs> oh well. Didn't make it. I made it pretty far, actually. Level 7. It's second best I've gotten. And the let's play anyway. I think my record is like level 8 or 9 <laughs> overall anyway though. I never actually beat this one. Okay, well that's all for today folks. Bye!